What's up? Today, we're going to find out who has the better stems. Little side note real quick, I am very sick right now, but uh, since the Serato update just came out, there's no rest for the wicket. So here we are. We ball regardless. I'm doing this for you guys. So please, for the love of God, like and subscribe because I am suffering right now. I have like massive cold chills. My throat's super sore. If you could see all the cough drops I've went through right now. Brother. Back in 2021, if I'm not mistaken, Virtual DJ first came out with one of the first softwares, if I'm not mistaken, to actually do stem like separation live within a DJ software. So in the serato update which just happened yesterday they're now releasing the beta version which you can test out which we're going to test out today i'm going to see which software is giving you the better stems this definitely had people switching over to virtual dj about a year ago just because it was one of the only ones that was offering like stem separation within a dj software but now that serato just did it there's a discussion to be had so let's try to take out everything but the vocal here and we're just going to jump right to the chorus Cause you're hot then you're cold You're yes then you're no You're in then you're out You're up then you're down You're wrong when it's white It's black and it's white We fight, we break up We kiss, we make up Now let's see what it sounds like in Serato Cause you're hot then you're cold You're yes then you're no You're in then you're now the first things that i'm noticing is that they're both yes they're making it but it sounds just like a diy acapella honestly that you have gotten throughout the years with any other software i will say from this song in specific i think serato sounds much better at converting the acapella right now than virtual dj does i feel like they heard what virtual dj did and then they just kept at it until they developed a better version of it and i think that's what they've done here is especially with the acapellas we'll see how the instrumental sound but i do think the acapellas sound significantly better in that first example the reason why i wanted to do this with hot and cold though is because i'm going to drop in the actual studio acapella and you can still hear the difference this is the chorus because you're hot there's still a little bit of resonance there but in the studio acapella because you're hot then you're cold you yes then you no. you're in then you're out you're up then you're down there's the delay isn't getting taken out um it doesn't sound like they're shelving out a lot of those like high mids and stuff like that the vocal is really present and it sounds full um, in these software, sometimes it can squash the vocal and make it sound like super flat, um, which is kind of what the software is doing here because it's basically just going through and removing a bunch of different parts at a very, very fast pace in order to create the acapella. So far, when it comes to acapellas, though, I will say if you have the studio acapella, it still reigns supreme. It sounds way better. All the effects are there. It doesn't sound like it's getting crunched or like squashed up, but so far, Serato definitely is in the lead when it comes to making DIY acapellas on the fly. And we're going to see how it does with making an instrumental. All right, now let's see how the instrumental sounds on the Serato version. Wow. When it comes to like the choruses and the guitars and like crash cymbals and stuff like that that's getting added, it's still struggling sometimes. Like from what I'm hearing with the software, with like my Technica's on right now, it's still, it sounds like that vocal's trying to like get through, but they're really just like pushing it and pushing it, pushing it down. But I will say again, what I noticed with the, like the Serato one specifically on like the verses or where there isn't all of the elements getting put together, you can easily make an intro and outro edit from any section 
in a song, especially with the instrumental version in Serato. And I think the instrumental version in Serato sounds even better than the virtual DJ one again. It really seems like Serato just took the time to like not rush it and develop a program that's reading and creating stems better than what virtual dj is and that's just simple business like they just they just made a product that's better in my opinion at stem separation at the moment in time now i don't want people to be like freaking out and think like this is immediately going to change like everything like yes this is going to change things but when it comes to like audio and things of that nature there's still about i think like five more years of technical growth that needs to occur until there is like a inseparable difference between a studio acapella and a diy made one if you have a chance to get your hands on the actual instrumental or the actual acapella that is still going to reign supreme i repeat that is still going to reign supreme when you're dealing with these really really big high quality sound systems that some people play on you don't want those resonant frequencies like coming through on these like big ass rigs granted i mean you could probably get away with it but if you're doing it for like an hour straight someone's gonna notice especially when you're doing the acapella separation i would maybe do that like once like if you're gonna do it now granted if you're just playing on like two qsc tops and you got like one sub and you're playing for like 100 people you could probably just fire away and you'll be fine but if you're playing on like the big big rigs i would definitely test it in those rooms before you do this. If I'm able to hear it through my headphones, those like resonant frequencies and how it still sounds like other stem separators out there, the higher end PA and audio is gonna eat this shit up. If you're fine with that, that's great. I still, I still think this is something that's incredible and will I probably use it? 100%. I think everyone needs to pump the brakes just a little bit. Is it amazing? absolutely it's incredible 100 percent. like they took what virtual djs did or bleh, i'm so ill right now this is terrible serato took what virtual dj did and they made it better this is better in every aspect than what virtual dj has currently for a product i hope you guys are excited about this sorry to anyone who's using virtual dj out there it had its run with the stem stuff but i do think serato is definitely um one-upping it for sure so if you're not on serato get on Serato.